Okay, so good afternoon, and thanks for coming here. Thanks for choosing this course, Introduction to Psychology. So if you go to this course, supposedly you can see here, 课程纲要, huh? let's switch to an English, English version because this is English medium course. Because this is English medium course, everything is going to be lectured and administered in English. And for you, for course participants, you must have an adequate level of English listening, reading, and writing. For listening, of course, because you have to listen to my lecture. So, of course, you have to be able to listen to English. Reading, because our textbook is in English. And also, for this course, we have an assignment. For that assignment, you have to, each of you has to read at least one research, academic research paper. And those papers are all written in English. Okay. So we have quite heavy loading in English reading. Another thing is the writing because the essay, you have to write the, the, the essay in English. What about speaking? Okay. Speaking English is not, it's not obligatory, but it's encouraged. So if, I have, if you have any questions in class or after class, you can ask me either in English or in Chinese. And if I, if I ask any question during the class and you want to respond, you can also respond in Chinese or English. So for speaking part, it's not obligatory to use English, but it's, it is encouraged. Okay, because I know that for most of you, of course, I, 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 I understand that people can speak English, but if I want you to speak in English in public, probably some people will get too nervous. Okay. So this is the prerequisite of this course. And so this is the textbook. So that was the syllabus. Okay. And the lecture slides, the PowerPoint files, they will be all uploaded on E3 before the lecture. Like, for example, for this one, for the first, first uh, lecture slide, it has been uploaded already. So if you have a computer or you have your phone, you can download it now. Okay. And these are the assignment topics. You have to choose one topic from these four. Okay. And what are they? Okay. The first one, intelligence, nature, or nurture. Intelligence is something everyone is curious about. We all have a general idea. Some people, they are more intelligent. Some people, they are probably not that intelligent. Some people, they are intelligent in mathematics. Some people, they are more intelligent in maybe languages. What is intelligence? Okay. And some people want to know that whether intelligence is determined by your genes or by the environment. Which one, genes or environment, which one is more important? Psychologists do have some answers to this topic, but people have different views. People have different opinions. And if you're interested in this topic, and I will assign you one paper about this issue, nature or nurture, and you can have a read of this paper and, give your, and write down your own opinions about this topic. Okay. The first one is intelligence. Second one, hypnosis, real or unreal. What is hypnosis? Hypnosis, when, you, when people think about hypnosis, people think about hypnotist. Hypnotist, who is standing on the stage and a group of participants. And the hypno hypnotist will say something like, whenever I do this, you will become a dog. Okay. And then, after a while, Nothing happens, but the hypnotizer or hypnotist does this. Those people, those participants, suddenly they become dogs. They start to bark like a dog. They start to crawl on the floor like a dog. Are they real or they are just acting? Okay. And also psychologists have some opinions about this. But of course, those opinions are not... Some people have different opinions. So if you're into this talk, kind of topic, you can choose the, this one. The third one, can we trust our memory? Okay, memory. 
when people think about memory, people think about memory is, is, is like the memory system seems to be like a you know, video recording device. Whenever we hear something, we see something, it becomes our memory. Okay? So memory supposedly should be real. But is it? Does it have to be real? Okay. Actually, psychologists have found some evidence suggesting that human memory could be somehow created or overwritten. Okay. There are some memories Actually, they don't exist, but because of some technique, they become exist. So memory, can we really trust our memory? Okay, this is the third topic. The final one is not that, the final one is more counterintuitive. Humans, angels, evils, or both, what does it mean? This is something to do with um, social psychology. What is social psychology? Social psychology studies how humans behave and think when they, whenever they are in different environment. You can probably you can't really understand this, but you can think about there are some religious, very radical religious or political groups. Okay? If you talk to every single individual in that group, you wouldn't find anything wrong. You might find this person is a nice person. It's really easy to hang out with. But why does this person belong to such a radical, extreme, religious, or political group? And they do many radical and extreme things in that group. Although, if you are interacting with one single person, you don't find anything wrong. But if you hear what that person does in the past or now, you might be surprised. So. It, it is kind of puzzling thing that how come a, the same person he would do such a different such different things in different contexts. Sometimes the same person could be an angel. Sometimes the same person could suddenly be turned to an evil. So are we? Do we really have our own free will? I mean, do we have to really decide what we want to do, or we are just kind of the tool? We are just like the puppet controlled by the environment or controlled by some, someone, uh, someone else. Psychologists have done some research about this topic and there have been some interesting findings. So if you're in, into this kind of topic, you should choose the final one. And of course, for each topic, I will assign you one or two research papers. So you don't have to write the essay from nothing. You have to write this essay from those uh, academic papers that I assign. Okay, so this is the assignment. Okay. And next week, we are going to spend more time on how to write a good assignment. Okay. So, and next week, I will assign one or two scientific papers for each topic. I don't do this this, I don't do this, this week. It's because there will be some other new people coming into the class next week. So I'm going to do everything together next week. Okay. And the due is on the 6th of May, midnight.